Well, hello everyone, it's Sheila back again with another tutorial and today I'm going to show how to do this pattern here. It's actually a um, pattern on a, um, a sweater pattern that I have. Um, I've had this pattern for a number of years, probably the late 80s, something like that. I have knitted it up before but I'd only knitted it plain, I didn't put the, um, the lacy pattern um, on it so I'm going to do this um, the pattern here and show how it's um, done and if anyone would like this pattern I'll put the um, my email address will be in the description box um, you can buy this pattern from Etsy or AB I think it's about um, $1.99 something uh, like that but, but if you want you can have it for free from me I'll do a PDF form and send it uh, if you send my your email address so this is how this um, pattern is done and I've started off, um, it doesn't matter how many stitches I have at the, um, the sides but um, it's nine stitches in between from the start of each set of, um, like, I suppose I call chevrons, that look like chevrons don't they? Um, this pattern is, it's a ten row pattern but every other row is pearl. And the rows in between are, are the lacy pattern. But it starts off the first two rows. First row is knit and the second row is purl. And then I'll start the, um, the V pattern. The chevrons. So I'm going to knit the first row. And I'll pause that till I get to the end. And I'm at the end of this row. And that's the first row, a knit row. And the second row is purl all the way across. And slip the first stitch. And then purl all the way across this row. And I'll pause this till I get to the end again. And I'm almost at the end of the row. Last three stitches. Last row knit. And I will start the first row of the um of the chevron. And if you'll notice this is quite the stitches are quite large. Um this pattern is double knitting, but it's knit on four millimeters needles for the ribs and five millimeters for the um the body part. And it's quite quick to um to knit up because of the size of the um the needle. So for anybody who's a slow knitter, it'll be a lot lot quicker. Now we're going to do the row with the first hole for the um the chevron. And it's slip the first stitch and then knit nine across on two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. We're going to bring the wool forward, slip the next stitch, knit the next stitch, and slip, pass that slip stitch over. And then knit nine on two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine. Yarn forward, slip one stitch, 
slip the next stitch and pass that slip stitch over and then knit to the end of the row And that's the first row of the chevron. And the next row is purl. So we slip the first stitch. And knit across the whole row. And I'll pause it till I get across that row. And I'm now at the end of that row. The last stitch, knit one. And now for the, the second row of the chevron, the third, actual third row. And you slip one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven stitches. Then the two together, yarn in front of the um the needle. Knit that centre stitch where the hole is. Yarn over needle, slip the next stitch, knit the next stitch and pass that slip stitch over. And then you knit one, two, three, four, five, six stitches. Knit those next two stitches together. Yarn in front of the needle. Knit that centre stitch over the hole. Yarn at the front again and slip one stitch and knit one stitch. And pass the slip stitch over. And then knit to end, to the end of the row. That's a third row of the pattern. We'll do the fourth, the fourth row. So another pearl row. Now pause that till I get to the end of the row. And I'm at the last three stitches. Pearl two and knit that last stitch. So now we're on to the fifth row of the, the chevrons. So I'm going to knit one stitch or slip one stitch, knit to six stitches. One, two, Three, four, five, six. And the next two stitches, a little tip for knowing exactly where to knit the stitches together. You have one straight stitch here, going down, running down. And then the stitch next to it is where the, the chevron goes in the middle. Those two stitches you knit together. And it's yarn over the needle and then you knit the three centre stitches. You yarn over the needle 
and on the other side we're going to slip a, knit a stitch and slip a stitch because you want them sloping this the opposite way to the um, the other side so we've got the yarn front of the needle slip that stitch the first stitch knit the second stitch and slip that stitch over and there you have the two the sloping the first one sloping outwards and that one sloping the opposite way and then we're going to knit five stitches in the middle one two three oh sorry it's only four stitches in the um the middle and again that keeps you right by the two stitches you have to knit together is that that one straight stitch going down there and the one that slopes down so you knit those two stitches together yarn at the front of the the needle knit the next three stitches yarn at the front of the needle slip the next stitch knit the next stitch and pass the slip stitch over and then knit to the end of that row And then the next stitch, next row, sorry, I'll pick some wool out here. It's another purl row, so you want to slip the first stitch and then purl across that row. And I'll pause it again till I get to the end. Now at the end of that row, the last three stitches, last stitch, knit one. So that's another, another row of the chevrons. And the last row for the chevrons that's one two three four five six and again you know where the um where you knit the two together because of the the stitch sloping down like that and the other stitch going down that knit those two stitches together Yarn forward, then you're going to knit one, two, three, four, five stitches, and yarn forward, and then you slip the first stitch, knit the second stitch, and pass that slip stitch over, and there you have the chevron sloping out over on each side and then it's knit three stitches in the center oh sorry it's only two stitches i went one too far there you knit two stitches in the um the center and then it's knit two stitches together yarn forward Knit one, two, three, four, five. Yarn forward, slip the next stitch and knit the next stitch and pass the slip stitch over. Knit to the end of the row. And the last row of the chevrons, purl. And 
and I'll pause that till I get to the end. And now the last three stitches. Knit, last stitch. And that's those chevron stitches. Very easy and quick to um, knit because of the um, the large size needles that um, we're knitting and it's not very open the stitch, the stitch is still quite, quite close. So if you like my video, would like to see more, thumbs up and subscribe.